This tutorial introduces the air management system and Profinet setup. For this video tutorial, we will be setting up the AMS system with the Siemens TIA portal. Here we will be using version 16 of the software. In order to set up the network topology, we need to install a GSDML configuration file. This can be downloaded from the SMC World website. After downloading the file, in TIA portal, click Options, and then select Manage General Station Description Files, GSD. In the source path, browse for the file location where the GSDML files are downloaded, and then click Select Folder. Select the checkbox and click Install. Now that the GSDML file has been successfully loaded, Click Close and the hardware catalog will be updated. The next step is to add the device to the TIA portal project. In the project tree, double-click on Devices and Networks. Select the Hardware Catalog tab and navigate to Other Field Devices. Expand the following sections, Profinet IO, Valves, SMC Corporation, and EXA1. Click and drag the EXA1 symbol, and place it next to the PLC, where a new image of the added device will appear. Next, we need to connect the newly added device, to the PLC. Click on the not assigned label, which is underlined. A small pop-up window will appear to allow us to select an I.O. controller. In this example, select PLC1, Profinet Interface 1. A connection has now been made between the PLC and AMS. Alternatively, you can connect the two devices by clicking the green box on one device and dragging it to the other, which will draw a connection to the AMS. We are now going to create a configuration using one base and one remote. Double click on the remote image. This will change to a device view. Open the Hardware Catalog tab and expand the Module section. To add the desired items to the configuration, either double-click or click and drag them to the configuration. First, we must bring in the diagnostic data, followed by the base. And finally, the remote. When we select any of the modules on either the base or remote, we are able to view their parameters in the General tab under Module Parameters. Here are most of the parameters that are available on the web server. Thank you, this concludes the video on the Air Management System and Profinet Setup.